Hey guys, so I decided I'm just going to make a video on um, Sophia night routine. So first I just, you know, gather all the stuff that I need for her, her, um, you know, the top, her towel, washcloths, all that goodies. So I'm just in her room getting all that stuff together while she's in her Greco playpen watching, you know, her cartoon and so on. Just getting out all that energy so she can go to sleep throughout the night yeah so this is pretty much just all of the things that i use i use the abino baby bath wash i use a baby organics honey um shampoo for her hair and i'm just checking the water i just bathe her um in the sink because my back really hurts when i have to bend over to give her a bath so i make her dad do you know her bath i just use the sink it works pretty well for now so yeah that's pretty good so she was crying being miss little grumpy pants so it's giving her some love some love i'm um, just taking off her clothes and stuff changing the diaper of course taking off all that stuff as you can see levi's in the back he's ready for the bed and in that little um cubby basket i have all of her little stuff that i may need for you know when I'm bathing her, changing her, all that good stuff. So I have that right there. So when I come back, I could just put her on the bed, get her dressed, and I don't have to, you know, turn my back or anything like that while she's on the bed. As you can see, she is going crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy girl. It's like she hates when I put her down after she like get picked up from out of her great coat pen she's like no don't put me down so see look at her she's going crazy she has so much energy <laughs> so yeah this is pretty much what i'm doing and then i'm just gonna bring her in the kitchen and give her start her bath a little cry cry look at her she is so spoiled so spoiled anyways so yeah i'm just scattering everything that i need and i'm all set now so this is now we in the kitchen uh the water was running so just double checking it make sure it's good for her okay kim i think the water is good now i checked the water so long <laughs> all right and she's in so um i give her like this little like teething toy to play with when we're in there or else she try to grab for everything else she try to grab for the water the brush the soap you got for everything so i just give her that to you know occupy her time while we're in the bathtub and i believe i fast forward the video soon you know so yeah I use the, I, this is why I love using the kitchen because I have that little hose right there. I can, you know, spur her down, all that stuff. So yeah, there we go. Speed, speed, speed. That shampoo that I use in her hair, it is amazing. She had super dry scalp and it got rid of it within like a few days so i just continue to use it because they have the honey in it and i think it's like helping her hair grow definitely so i like it it's very good very very good and it's all natural she loves getting a bath i love giving her a bath in the night because it gets to you know soothe her she gets the i don't know what it is but she used so much energy in the bathtub that by the time she's done she's tired and ready for bed so yeah that's it just like a 10 minute bath you know that's good enough for her <laughs> my little baby say hi mama <laughs> And now we are in the room. Levi's still there, like ready to go to bed. I'm just putting on her cartoon just for now, just to keep her occupied 
so that she don't start getting grumpy and going crazy she is so silly she try to grab for everything now and she is like ready to start walking that's how she she is she's just like i am ready to go mom i do not want to stay here i want to just keep going and keep going so as you can see she, she's trying to grab for the basket and I just, you know, use um, the aquaphor. Then I rub a little bit of the Avena lotion on her after. Just for, you know, some scent. The lavender is, like, very um, calming and, like, soothing. So I get within all those little folds of hers. She has so many folds. Chucky, chucky, girl. And I use a, um, olive oil in her hair sometimes. Mostly it's just coconut oil, raw coconut oil I put in her hair. But I will switch back and forth between the olive oil and the coconut oil. So normally like after I get her dressed and everything and she is you know all set then I'll focus on myself but for you know when we get in if we had a long day out this is what I normally do if we didn't go out and we stayed the, the, you know the day in I just would give her like a little bed bath kind of you know just a little wipe down nothing major because she had her bath in the morning so there's no need really for me to give her like a bath I feel when we're out you know I'll definitely do that and people hug her hold her and all that fun stuff so I put in her great ghost while I you know put away all the stuff that I was using playing with her little sofa giraffe and at night I put on the diffuser um, sometimes I use the chamomile sometimes I use the lavender um, oil so that night I was using um chamomile and the diffuser is amazing I've used this throughout my pregnancy like from she was born like we constantly use it and um, I got this from Amazon I love it so much it has like lights on it so you know instead of having like a little night light we just use that and it has different setting um, how long you want it to be on so we do that then I put on some white noise for her. I use a TV or my phone sometimes. And see Levi is like ready to go. He's like, come on, any day now. <laughs> so I'm just feeding her. I like to get her full, you know, nice and full. She sleeps throughout the whole night. She normally goes to bed at like 10 or so. And then she just gets up at like about 8, 8.30 in the morning. She, so she sleeps throughout the whole night. And that's pretty much like what we do in a night. She stays asleep and that's it. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe.